So the main method of sound collection that we use is scuba diving. So we just use a small hammer, maybe a small chisel or a pair of pliers to take small samples of the coral. For deeper depths we use the ROV robot. That can go down to 120 metres, which is more than enough for what we need. So we've just got these samples now that we're processing and the first step um, for these ones in particular is that we need to cut them into multiple pieces so we can um, then use those fragments for our different analyses. A small sample is taken for um, genetics and that goes into a genetics uh, preserving solution. We also take a small sample for to look at the reproduction of the corals and that goes into um, a preservative that preserves the tissue. Some will be preserved in liquid nitrogen for pigment analysis. Finally we have the bleached skeleton sample. The skeleton is important because that um, is how you identify them. Um, so yeah, there's quite, a, quite several different samples are taken uh, and that takes quite a bit of time.